Welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm going to show you guys uh, my take. I'm going to give y'all a review on the cre Cremo Bourbon and Oak. Give you guys my take on it. Had a little time to play around with it. But y'all y'all saw my unboxing before this video. So, I told you guys I'm giving a little wearings and get my review on it and let you guys know my take. Now, this, I caught this on sale on Amazon for 14 bucks, which I thought was a heck of a good deal. Uh, I just want to ball a light close up. It's cream old bourbon and oak. Here's the chrome itemizer, kind of chromish top. Kind of like plastic inside. I believe that it is metal it sound like metal anyway doesn't matter it's the top show you guys the spray on this that's what we get spray is good spray is very good that being said now let me get a sniff on it it smells really really good you get a lot of the oak in here and the notes is on the box right there. If you got interested in the notes, it is saying the top notes are distillery spice. The middle notes are single, single cash bourbon. And the base notes are white oak. All right. And the middle notes is single cash bourbon. And the notes are right there. Once again, y'all can read them for you. See them. All right. Now, I would say at the price of 14 bucks on Amazon, you definitely cannot beat the deal of this fragrance. All right, let's hit myself one more time. I love to show you guys the spread. How she pumps out there. Top fits tight. Fits pretty tight. You can hold it the bottle by the cap. Take a little force, as you can see there. So yeah, let me get my take on it. Now, when I first apply this to the skin, you get about a good hour and a half to two hours of projection. You do get a lot of that uh, oak. I can get the oak out of this. Similar scents this remind me of. It reminds me a little bit of aquarium silver. If you like aquarium silver, you'll like this. Uh, Kind of reminds a little bit of original penguin. It's got that vibe without that oak smell and uh, aquarium silver. It reminds me a little bit of Riviera English Laundry. Uh, it's got that vibe going on with it, but this here has more oak in it. And um, it smells very good. That being said, uh, longevity, y'all know I don't really get too deep into longevity, but I do give y'all my ballpark. Uh, figure about how long I think this fragrance lasts. That being said, for bourbon and oak cremo, I would say you'll get somewhere between somewhere between now I've been testing it. Somewhere between four and six hours of longevity out of this fragrance. That being said, now y'all know like I tell you, I don't get too deep in longevity. I just believe in taking it out. Spraying it again. That's just how I believe, you know. <laughs> I believe it's just spraying the thing again, and you good to go. That's just me. You know, I don't know why I'm like that, but, man, because I don't expect none of these fragrances that last for so long. You know, I just feel like you, you wear them for a couple hours. If it starts to fade, just reapply. And then, that's the best way to do, to be, to be honest. I mean, I don't expect miracles from none of these fragrances. You know, after about four hours, I just reapply it because I feel like, hey, it's a cheaper fragrance and it's, you know, somewhat fading. So what the heck? And I got dry skin, as you can see, and pretty much don't too many, no kind of colognes really last that good on me. I always got to kind of hit my clothes like this. For to actually carry on the fragrance. 
And that's the only way I really get a lot of longevity out of my fragrances is I hit my clothes. Now, if I hit my clothes, it'll stay right there. But on my skin, like y'all just saw me go ham on my hoodie, then I get good longevity out of it that way. But on the skin, this giant ain't lasting to four to six hours by all of them to get out of it. Now, that being said, uh, the best time to rock this fragrance, I would say on a date night with your wife, with your girlfriend, you're going out to eat, going out to grab some subs, going out to grab some pizzas, or whatever the case might be, you know, this is going to be good for that. You're going to be smelling good to, to your wife or your girlfriend. And you're going to just know this is going to last somewhere between four and six hours. If you're going to be out longer than that, you can always carry a little small decan or something where you can refresh it up with it. In a couple hours, you're just going to have to reapply. You know, this I'm just keeping it real with you. But most of the time, you're going out with your wife or your girlfriend, pretty much you ain't going to be out too long. You might be out four hours, five hours, and you're going to be back to the crib. You know, that's how I do anyway. So uh, that being said, uh, you know, good fragrance. I can see this being worn for something formal. Like if you got an office meeting or something like that, this will fit right in. You're going to just be smelling good and fresh. You won't offend nobody. Nice little oak, oak note in here. You probably get tons of compliments. I can see it's been a compliment getter. People that smell you, definitely going to compliment you and tell you how good it smells. Now, similar scents, once again, this reminds me of quarry, a lighter version of Quarry and Silver. It's got that vibe. I guess it's that that woody, that uh, bourbon, and that oak. That, that oak vibe was what's giving that Quarry and Silver vibe. It's that oak. It's got, I smell like oak wood in here because it's it, what it is, bourbon and oak. So you get a strong oak note coming out of here. That oak is, ain't nothing to play with. It smells good, man. Yeah, that oak note smells good in here. It smells like fresh cut wood, fresh cut oak. This does smell good. So anyway, uh, that's my take on it. I know these been out, but still, you know, everybody got to get their take on it. I get my take on it. Like I said, longevity is somewhere between four or six hours. I don't care. It's cheap. I can spread all I want to. If I run out, I just order another bottle. You know, no big deal to me. I don't mind spraying them. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. If new to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, y'all stay tuned for more videos. I'll hit y'all on the next one. I'm out of here. It's cream old bourbon and oak. I'm out. That's my take. Peace.